G'day, g'day, it's Gibbo, that geek caveman. I'm doing a quick video, and it's going to be about the new ad blocker that Chrome has added to its web browser. So if you're using Google Chrome and you've got the latest version, you have an ad blocker now built in. Some people do have their own ad blockers that they like to use. I'm not a fan of them. Most ad blockers will actually allow ads if you pay for them to get through. Also, they collect your information and sell it. That's how they make their money. So by using the Google Chrome's built-in ad blocker, um, yes, Google gets all your information, but they get it anyway because that's their browser. So it doesn't actually make much of a difference. The big thing that Google Chrome's ad, uh, blo ad blocker is doing is it's actually changing the internet. And it already has. It's only been out for a couple of days. But if you go to news.com.au, um, you'll actually notice that the web page is usable now. I used to not use it at all because of the pop-up ads and all the bits and pieces that were on there. It was just horrific. No one liked it. It was terrible. Um, they've actually changed their website because they knew this was coming. Uh, a lot of other websites have done the same. So basically what happens is is if Google goes onto the website, they see you've got an auto run one that plays a video when you first get there or has an ad that pops up over the top of the article you're reading or something like that. At the moment, you'll see a little thing that says Google is starting to make the ad better or they're going to start blocking ads. So they'll do this a couple of times, see if it's going to get changed. If it doesn't get changed, they will actually black block all ads on the web page, including their own ads. So if the web page does not allow, uh, does has these bad ones, Google will actually take their own ads off there. The idea being that they won't get any revenue, even from Google, because there's no ads being shown on there. So this is hopefully going to change the internet for the better. We'll actually get web pages with less annoying ads. Ads are needed. We do need ads to support these free web pages, free stuff that we use. So that's fine. That's good. I never run an ad blocker. I deal with it. I just don't go to web pages that have bad ads. And now Google's going to make it so no web pages will have bad ads for me. So this is a really good thing. Anyway, if you have any questions about it, you can hit me up and have a look. Uh, hit me up and I'll have a look and let you know what I can. Or just do the searching yourself. That's always the best way. Do some research, find it out. But yeah, this is a, not a bad thing. So if you're using Google Chrome, I would actually suggest removing any ad blockers you've already got. Or just be aware that it is going to change things um, for the better. Anyway, see you later. Bye.